Good morning. We'll begin our practice in extended child's pose. Bring your knees wide, big toes touching, and allow your forehead to rest on the earth. Take a moment to set your intention for your practice or your day ahead. Inhale, come to tabletop, stack your shoulders over your wrists and your hips over your knees. Move through your cat-cow as you inhale, arch the back, gaze forward, broaden through your collarbones, and as you exhale, tuck the tailbone round the spine. Inhale, arch. Exhale, round. Inhale, arch. Exhale, round. Inhale, come to center. Tuck the toes, exhale, downward facing dog, send your hips up and back. Feet are hip width distance apart, spread the fingers wide. Gaze between your thighs and imagine you're in a nice inverted V. Inhale, lift your right leg, flex your foot, square your hips. Exhale, step your right foot between your hands, lower your left knee down to the ground, and inhale, sweep your arms to the sky for a low lunge. Soften your shoulders down and away from your ears. And then begin to shift your weight into the left knee as you straighten the right leg for half splits, one hand on either side of the right thigh. Flex your right ankle. You can always have blocks here. And then bring your right foot all the way to the right side of your mat for lizard pose. Bend the right knee. Bring the hands to the inside of the foot. Hug your right knee in towards your shoulder. You can stay right here. Bend your back knee. Plant through the left palm and reach back with the right hand for the top of your foot. And then come to pigeon pose. Bring your right heel outside your left hip. Extend the left leg behind you. Square yourself forward and then begin to fold. Inhale, gaze forward, crawl the fingertips back, come back to your downward facing dog. Option to stay here, take a vinyasa, inhale forward to high plank. Exhale, lower all the way down to the earth, elbows in. Inhale, cobra pose, lift the chest. Exhale. Lower the chest back to the earth, come through tabletop, tuck the toes, downward facing dog. Inhale, lift your left leg, flex your foot, square your hips. Exhale, step the left foot between the hands, lower your right knee down to the earth, and inhale, sweep your arms up to the sky for low lunge.
Exhale, half split, straighten the left leg, flex through the left ankle as you shift the weight into your right knee. Lizard pose, bring the left foot to the outside of the mat. Both hands come to the inside of the left leg as you bend your left knee. Hug your left knee in towards your left arm. You can stay here, bend the back knee, reaching back with the left hand for the top of your foot. Slowly release, come to pigeon pose, bring the left heel outside the right hip, square yourself forward, and then slowly begin to fold. Inhale, gaze forward, crawl the fingertips back. Exhale, come back to your downward facing dog. Option to stay here or flow, inhaling to high plank. Exhale, lower down to the earth. Inhale, cobra. Exhale, come through tabletop, downward facing dog. And then come down onto your bum, straighten your right leg and bring the sole of your left foot to the inner thigh. Square yourself forward as you fold over that right leg, flexing your right foot toward the sky. Nice and slow release. And switch sides, straighten the left leg, bring the sole of the right foot to the inner thigh, square yourself forward, and then begin to fold. Slowly release and either come to a seated position for meditation or you can take traditional Shavasana laying on the back, closing the eyes. Your choice here. Take a moment to come back to your intention. Come back to your breath. And just know that you have nowhere else to be but in this moment.
I invite you to stay here as long as you like. This is where I'll leave you today. Thank you so much for practicing with me. Please remember to like, subscribe, share, and donate to support this channel. Namaste.